Hi, good morning. It is what time is it? 6:59, 7 o'clock. So I'm early, 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 and yeah, I am taking you on a road trip. And for this road trip, um, yeah, you'll see where we're going. But I wanted to leave a scripture with you. You probably can't even see it properly. Let me go like to the side side. So the scripture of the day comes from Psalm 23. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I'll fear no evil, for thou art with me. and I was thinking on scriptures that speak about God's protection and uh, you know Psalm 23 came to mind Psalm 23 talks about a lot of stuff God's how God provides how God protects how God keeps like how God is our shepherd essentially and I just wrote down that scripture of the day so I'm actually using this mirror because I don't use this mirror for like looking into i have another mirror on the other side and then i have a smaller mirror those are the ones i use one for shoes and one for the rest of my outfit so i was like hmm why not make a daily habits top three goals and scripture of the day um mirror <laughs> basically so in essence all you're doing is let me show you so all you're doing is writing your daily habits so I have self-care, it's going to look a little bit here, business, daily life, and spiritual life, right? So all of those, um, all of them will not be done every day. So like this one, you see it's Thursday to Saturday. And this is content creation, by the way. So CC content creation. So I usually do between Thursday and Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Something seemed weird a little while ago. But yeah, so, and then after that, I have top three. But since we're going to be out on the road today, we don't really have a top three except for to have fun. So it's the top three goals you want to accomplish. That doesn't mean they're the only goals you want to accomplish for the day, but it's the top three that you prioritize to get done. And then at the end, I will write a scripture after meditating and journaling in the morning. I didn't meditate or journal in the morning, this morning rather. But yeah, I was just thinking on the scriptures that deal with protection and whatever and basically this is my mirror <laughs> or one side of my mirror it just helps as a visual um representation um i know we write down our goals sometimes but sometimes having them like literally slap you in the face kind of thing or writing down habits that you want to you know um you know start or work on and different different things like that and having them like literally slap you in front of your face like how i have them right there it makes them easier for you to get them done so yeah that's just me showing you what i've been up to today so anyways let's 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 get on with it shall we For those of you who don't know, I live in St. Catherine, so I have to travel on Flatbridge, then the North South Highway onto Mandela. Then we headed to Barbican to pick up my bestie. Hey doggy. Oh, hey doggy. Welcome to the vlog. <laughs> they haven't seen you forever. Like that last time we went out. <laughs> last year you mean? You mean last year? <laughs> Thank you. 
Then to actually get to our destination, we went through Stony Hill. From Stony Hill, it takes us about an hour and 10 minutes to get to our destination, which is in St. Mary, my dad's stomping ground after he moved to Jamaica from Belize. To be exact, we were headed to Strawberry Fields together in Robins Bay. Yeah. <laughs> oh fuck. You know mm -hmm. Somebody may that tell somebody can tell somebody for walk with a sheet, brother. A sheet? Yeah, for spread for spread on the lawn, because you have to treat them and that would be last time. Well, so why you never tell me because I have well it's not a, blanket. a huge blanket but the one go. Yeah. 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 Reach guys. Reach. I have mine. I have mine. <laughs> so I really just you. <laughs> ah, reach. Um, today is a good day to it's be at the beach. The sun. Cause the sun, the sun is, is so hot. Hot. Today is the perfect day to be at the beach. Perfect. Perfect day. Perfect. We day. literally could not have chosen a better day. Literally. What? first time here at strawberry fields as you can see it's not much of a beach but it's really cool this is one side to it they have different sides so this is really really pretty and stuff you know um i hear there's a side over here that actually has sand so i'm gonna go and look and fast and see what i'm gone um so <laughs> Funny story, so the entry is a thousand dollars or so we think. Um, but we came in, nobody asked us for any money, and we are walking freely, we can use the facilities, all kind of stuff, and yeah. So it's okay. There's a little cliff thing magic right there. Let's soon show you on the oh okay. I'm quite brave. I didn't take my my thing my bob with me. My case with me. But yeah, so that's this part with the sun. It's looking quite nice. I actually like it. I'm gonna come back but with my case and thing and thing. So as maybe just say we're supposed to pay to come in a thousand dollars. I don't know if that's still the case. If by the time I upload this video, anybody, any representative from Strawberry Field see this, I'm sorry, but like there was nobody there to take any money from me. But your place is really nice though. And so far, yeah. So anyways, then people are dragging me out, kind of hungry belly. I'll probably go through, you know what? Path of least resistance. Kind of hungry belly and I don't know how I'm going to survive because I say I shouldn't buy food here, so yeah, let's see how this is going to I'm going to get something to drink because I'm thirsty, so I can't go up here, I'm a bit thirsty and stuff, but let's see how this day's day goes and stuff, I'm climbing, oh, here we go, but the place is like really, really nice, like really, really nice. Alright, I'll go on. I don't even know if you guys can hear me. What happened? I don't even know if you guys can hear me. Oh, the water is beautiful. 
but there are a lot of stones well the section that we went to i don't know if the other side is like that but this is the section with the sand and yeah but the water is like really beautiful oh, yep lots of stones so if you have water shoes cracks you know it would be best to use that um but yeah it's really 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 beautiful i'm loving it i'm really loving it and what i don't know what i'm stepping on but it's i don't know what i'm stepping on but it's sticky <laughs> it's so sticky <laughs> i really don't know what i'm stepping on does it stop no it doesn't <laughs> whoa but yeah, I don't know what was that. No? That's why I felt all of it. <laughs> but yeah, the water nice still. I'm, I'm so happy. I'm going where Akil is. Cause over there so look clean up. Yo, at the clean part while walking, I'm asking you some sticky something. The drag right, that's a camera. Woo! Yeah, it has a lot of drag. Nah, I ain't a quitter. Toss me the ball, I'm a really big hitter. Big picture, I'm a straight killer. Rass in the song to the highest bidder. Got juice, got gas, I'ma move fast. New shoes, new tracks, like who's that? I'm new, come back better than Strawberry Fields Together, named after the Beats. The song is an 18 acre property that hosts a beachfront view and a small white sand beach. It also has cottages and villas for rent for those looking for a weekend getaway. Overall, it's had a very chill vibe, which is great for couples and even families. While we didn't take or buy our own food with the exception of snacks, they do offer food for purchase and they do allow outside food as well. The property can serve as a wedding venue for picnics, can be used for fitness and wellness retreats, for team building exercises as we saw when we went there, and so much more. All in all, it's a great place for relaxation and chill vibes between friends and family. Just forget your water shoes. The dilemma is figuring out what yeah, we need to eat. <laughs> and then somebody is going to order these. Let us show. Alright, let's go. Load them people. Because the way I'm hungry, I'm feel Open weak. Oh, let's go. So, guys. We are leaving. It is. We have curfew, guys. So, we have to leave early. It's 2 21. We have to leave early because of curfew, which is at 6. It's 2 21. Yo, where's the biscuits? And yeah. Overall, the place chill. Like, what is your water? You've been here before, right? Yeah. I mean, it's good. There's a lot of people this time. Oh well, it's my first time, so um, I like I like the chill vibe. Hey guys, guess what? I got crackers. I wish it was less stones. I got crackers. Woo! kind of want some. Hello. Bring those back. <laughs> I'm talking. I'm giving a review. I'm giving a review of. Do uh, not come to this beach without cracks. Facts. I don't know what was in the water earlier, but y'all saw that, right? Uh -huh. Okay. Want some of the crackers this too? This skin looks so nice. For sure. Oh, thank you, lifesaver. Oh, uh, hey. Anybody else want crackers? Yeah, give me some. We're the food. So, we got food, we got festival and chicken from this place called Oriental Fried Chicken, is it in? Mm -hmm. And it's in Junction, so, how did you, oh you don't eat the chicken, well, CN would know because CN made a suggestion, so I hope, hopefully the chicken is really good, but if it's busting, I'll let you know. I'm just hungry right now. 
I want it's definitely going to be a boss <laughs> Exactly. Anyways, I've ended the vlog here. See you next time, next place, next location. And Pokemon Go. And Zayma Oh no, and Dragon Ball Z. Next time on Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> Anyways, don't forget to like, subscribe, follow me on Instagram and on Twitter. And if nobody yet, never tell you no. Hello, hello.